Welcome back to a story about my uncle. So to make up for all the previous episodes, we're not going to talk anything about performance or anything right away now, unless the game like completely shits its pants later on. But for now, all I want to say before I get into the gameplay is that I tweaked the audio a little bit more, because I still felt that I needed to boost the uh, dialogue volume a little bit. So I lowered the other two, and then in post-production and editing, I'll just even everything out, so... That should be good. We should be good to go in terms of the uh, audio balance now, hopefully. So, let's just get into the game and have an actual... actual episode of the game that we're playing. Playing the game and doing things that you're supposed to do. Um, do I just do this? And then, like, fly forward? And then try to land on this, I guess? And there's a thing here? Which is probably a secret? Yeah, it's one of those. Okay, cool. Beep, beep, beep. Got the thing. Thank you, you can, like, leave me now, this press left click. I don't think it's gonna leave ever. I think I might have to just do this. Is it gonna leave now if I do this? Or is it just not leaving until you're actually done with this section? I guess so. And yeah, there's some sort of air strafing... Oh, what the hell just happened? I couldn't make a long jump. There's some form of... Oh, that was a bad jump. Some form of air strafing in this game. Not quite like Source Engine air strafing, but you do have some mobility while you're in the air. But, I don't know, there's some weird stuff going on with momentum, I've noticed, where... Yeah, if you walk off uh, an edge, you just get sent flying compared to just jumping. I don't know. We'll see if that comes into play later on. Here we go, finally a new checkpoint. This thing will not leave me though, this fucking message. What is happening? And now, I do this, get up here. Yeah. Wasn't there anything... Oh, uh, hmm. Wow. I feel like the FOV is a little bit low still, but wasn't there anything... Should I go, like, can I go out here? I don't think I can, but... No, this is way too far away. Okay, never mind. Oh. Okay, I'm fine. Can you please leave me alone, this thing? I'm gonna see if I kill myself again. It's still there. I guess we'll... Oh, wait. No? Okay. I'm gonna return to menu, and then we're gonna continue, and hopefully that'll be gone. Yeah. Also, that's a weird loading in animation where you load in the textures, but I kind of like it. Yeah, I think that was just bugged, where that message just wouldn't go away. Combining Power Leap and the Grapple will let you reach far-off areas. Yeah. Great. Fantastic. That's what I've been doing already, but... So you're the supposed to... The adventure suit was fantastic. By combining a Power Leap with a Grapple... Yeah, thank you. I could fly long distances through the air You already said this through text speed. on the screen. It's right there. Okay. I'm just gonna check around so I don't miss anything. Yeah, that's just where we were. I'm not sure I'll be able to get all the uh, pickups. Maybe I'll have to have a second playthrough going through and picking up all the secrets and whatnots. We'll see. Checkpoint. I did notice in the uh, stage select area, there is, or menu rather, there is actually only five real levels in this game. So this is called, oh god. This is called the Sanctuary, and the first level is just the workshop, but that's just a, an intro level, and then there's... Ooh. Then there's also... Uh, so I guess I just do normal sprint jumps here. Yeah. Then there's also the epilogue, which I guess is probably not its own complete area, I would imagine, but who knows, we'll see. Long jump. And there we go. Checkpoints. No, that's not even a checkpoint. You're just supposed to grapple, which I didn't need to, but all right. I can get up here. I think you're just supposed to... What are you supposed to do here? Get up this way? Nope, but you can. Well, I guess that's fine. When grappling a moving object, you will follow along, so you won't... Like, if I do this and I grapple, the grapple lets go, even if I keep holding the button. You can't, like, stick to a surface. But if it's a moving object, maybe it does. Ha-ha! Ha-ha! I found you! Beep-boop. Yeah, 
I am a little bit observant about secrets and pickups and stuff, but as I said, I'm not sure I'll be able to get all of them. We'll see. Three out of five so far, though, and the level is hopefully far from over. So I just do this. Yeah, it just sort of keeps me at the same distance in a weird way. Huh, that's interesting. So normally you reel in your grappling hook, but not when it's a moving object, or I guess it, like, counteracts the movement. I'm not sure. I gotta sneeze. Sneezes have been had. Alright, let's check behind, just in case. I probably should get this checkpoint first before I do anything stupid. There we go. Let's just look around here, just in case. Oh god! No, I could have saved myself, but I was too slow. And then you just long jump and grapple this thing. Like so, and swing up here. Yep. Alright, cool. I feel like there might be something... I'm just gonna go get this checkpoint here. Like that. There might be something up here. Uh, let's do it like this. And jump up here. Grapple here. There we go. Let's take a look around. Maybe not. Maybe I'm thinking too hard about all this. Oh, okay, can't stand there. Alright. Yeah, it doesn't seem like there's anything. Just gotta be observant about... Oh. Things like that. Is that a thing? Let's see. Oh god, I overshot it. But I still got it. Yep. Four out of five. Just one more. Okay. Nice. And is that the last one, maybe? That's kind of secluded and doesn't really look to be part of the actual level, so I guess I just die now, or I can do this. Yeah, that works. This is what I was supposed to do anyways, right? And another checkpoint. Yeah, now we're making loads of progress. Let's jump down here. Man, that's very satisfying, just falling down that... Oh, this is... Have I hit this yet? Hold on. Did I... Yeah, I did. I actually kind of didn't want to, because I thought this was a secret, not where I was supposed to go. But I guess... It is. So I might have missed something. Hopefully not. We'll see, I guess. Just gonna have a look around here. It looks very... Gray, this place now. Is that just because I upped the gamma a tiny bit? Let me just check that. If I just lower this to the default value. Now it's still like kind of a grayish filter, so I'm gonna keep it where I had it. I guess this cave is just sort of foggy, or at least that's the effect that's used by the. Oh god, that's weird. Unreal Engine, the fog effect, and this is it, and looks kind of strange. Okay, so now, where do I go? This way? Oh, yeah, okay, I see. Yeah, I feel like I might have missed something there, or here. Huh. That's a shame. I think you can replay levels, though. Hopefully. I guess we can check once we get the uh, the next level completed. Follow along this. And let go! An air strafe! Hooray! No problem. Oh, yeah, I did notice, or realize that you can sort of use this for fast travel. If you use it on the ground, you immediately get your grappling hook back, so you can kind of like chain them. I'm not sure if it's actually any faster than just running. But yeah, that definitely looks suspicious, but maybe not. We'll see. We'll see if I find the last thing by the time I get to the... Ooh! Aha! You found a second power core. You can now grapple two times before landing. 
Sweet! And I guess three times at the end of this level, and then you get into the new levels, and this is like the tutorial level, and once you're in the next level, it's like serious business! Lit! Blah blah blah, indicate how many grapples you have left. Yeah, that's what I imagined or assumed. I'm just gonna check up here. Why not? Like behind here? Anything? I think this is just a random ledge. Yeah, this is nothing. Alright, let's keep moving then. So now... I do this kind of thing, and then grapple, and then wait, and then grapple. Yeah, simple enough. Bam. Huh. I wonder, these symbols, do they mean anything, or are they just sort of decorative? Like this one, and that one. I guess they're just decoration, but it's kind of strange. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. There's a light here. That looks suspicious to me. But perhaps not. I'm just gonna jump here and check it out, because why not? I think I'm gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna black out before I get there. Now I have to make this jump again. This very, very challenging jump. Could be something up there, but probably not. And yeah, on this thing, this is probably nothing. Let's just jump across here. Yeah, doesn't seem like it. Is it just me, or I kind of want to increase the FOV a little bit more? Just a tiny bit? Maybe I should just do that. I don't know, I feel like... It's still a bit claustrophobic in some situations, so maybe just like that, a hundred. That might be a little bit better. Yeah, I kind of like this more so far, we'll see. Alright, checkpoint here. And I'll just check around here, of course. What's this? Oh, that's the thing! Wow, that wasn't hidden very well. Five out of five, okay, so no more secrets. I feel like there could be a lot more Seekers in this place if you actually wanted to put in some sneaky ones. Oh, let's go! And then you have to, like, swing across and then hook onto this one. Yep. Makes sense. It all makes sense. So now I guess I don't really need to be as keen on finding secrets because I've already found all of them, but I kind of still want to. Oh, god, wait, hold on. Wait, and then land up here. And then... Grapple up. Oh god, I went through the thing! Oh god, it's not even here! It's not... It doesn't have corporeal form. Holy crap. I guess we'll just keep moving then. Oh, let's go. And... This one. And then up there. Very straightforward so far. And yeah. Frames seem really good. Sorry, I said I wouldn't talk about performance, but frames seem good. Everything seems good. What's walking? Because it's like a special place. Yeah. Okay. Probably story time. That's a weird looking sweater. That's very stiff. I don't think the sleeves should be like that on a normal sweater. But that's just me. What is this? Candy? Nuts? I don't even know. I'm gonna wait with uh, clicking that, just to check around. Looks like that's the only thing. Alright, so let's click on them. Did you ever see any of Fred's experiments yourself? Yes. I actually helped him collect samples for his research sometimes. To learn about them? That's right. We found all sorts of things. One time, we went to the forest and found a small pool of water that was full of eggs. Eggs? Were there chickens in the forest? No, not chicken eggs. These were small and jelly-like. Hundreds of them. Fred told me that they were frog eggs. He was in for a surprise, though. Guess what happened? What? What happened? Well, we took some eggs back home, and one day, 
Fred woke up with bites all over his body. Turns out it wasn't frog eggs after all. It was mosquito eggs. Ah, oh, poor Fred. I know. He did find real frog eggs eventually. He told me that they were very, very special, but I don't know what happened to them. Are these supposed to be frog eggs? Also, how do you mistake frog eggs for, or mosquito eggs for frog eggs? I guess they're very, very large mosquitoes, maybe? I don't even know. Yeah, I could head up here, but... Ah, can't stand there, never mind. Yeah, I keep wanting to do out-of-bounds stuff and just getting up where I shouldn't. Because that's fun. To see where you can break the level and break the game. Another ladder here. Some lanterns. What was that for? Did I need that? I guess you were supposed to grapple it, but... Oh well. Checkpoint. I'll get that on the next cycle. I'm just gonna have a quick look around. Doesn't seem like there's anything. Oh, never mind. We'll have to wait one more. Yeah, nothing. Get ready. Here we go. I see. Okay, and now we have to grapple stationary targets to, like, stabilize in the air and stuff. And this thing... Oh, let's go. Yep, no problem. Just looking back to see if there's any stuff Seems pretty clear. Oh, and that's probably the, the last third crystal. No, it's not. It's just a lantern. Or lamp, or whatever. Okay. Nothing yet. Hmm. These blue lights. Did Fred put them here? Or was somebody else oh, I can here as well? Oh, level complete? I guess level complete. And now comes the real test. In a new level, will the frame rate tank as hard? It went down to 60, but it seemed kind of fine now. If I look in this direction, it's still about 70, so it seems alright. We'll just have to go with it. We'll have to see if it ever drops below like 40, then I will actually look into it and see what I can do about it lower some settings and stuff like that, but if it's just like this, yeah, it, like, dipped a couple frames, I don't think it's really noticeable, and I don't think it's really a problem, it's Hello. just kind of... who are you? Oh, jeez, hi. You're not from here. Wow, you look just like Fred, but smaller. Okay. And with less hair on your face. <laughs> she knew Your glasses Fred. are broken. I told her that he was my uncle, and that I was looking for him. I can't jump on her head. What's an uncle? I said that he was. That I had known him all my life. Is an uncle someone you've known really? all your life? Me too. I'll help you find him. That doesn't make any sense. I'm Madeline. The others call me Mad Maddie sometimes. I don't know why really. But you can call me Maddie. You've never sure. been to the village, right? Let's meet over there in the square. I'll show you around. Is she gonna like fucking I bet you do some frog hops? Easily with your suit thing. So, I'll see you there. I couldn't believe it. An underground village cool. inhabited by frog people. Or more like salamanders. Either way, they, they walked like humans, they talked like humans. How is that possible? Being a Let's Player myself, and doing a lot of sound editing and sound processing and stuff like that, I have a very keen sense to hear annoying things, because I hear them in my own recordings, like lip smacking and lip clicking and tongue clicking and like S sounds being too sharp, and that girl's voice, or her microphone's voice rather, that voice actress, that was kind of annoying. She had a very like audible sort of smacking sound, like, 
that kind of thing when she talks. I don't know. It's weird sometimes. I've heard that in, like, professional stuff. You just sometimes hear a really sharp S or something that they didn't retake for some reason. Or a weird, like, clicking... I don't know, I am really self-conscious about that in my own stuff, so now I've gotten really conscious about that in other people's stuff as well. Oh, that's cool! Oh, I didn't know that! So if you fall and you're falling really fast, if you grapple, the grapple has sort of a maximum velocity, I guess? So I just slowed my descent by grappling, it didn't actually speed it up, which is kinda cool, kinda neat to know. Checkpoint here. Uh, collectibles. Five collectibles. Okay, so I need to be wary of those as well. And once again, just one of these. Get up here, and then up here. Great. And yeah, I'll, I'll keep going a little bit. It's probably about the time where I would normally end it anyways, but oh, I just wasted both of my things, but... Again, the episodes have been kind of shorter and more pointless up until this point, so I think you deserve a little bit of an extra one. Can I? Yeah, I can grapple that. And then swing up here and then grapple this. Yeah, sweet. So far I like the movement mechanics of this game a lot. Feels very... Hey! Hello? Hey, who? What? Hey! Hey! Hi. Just Over a sec. Here. Just a sec, I'm gonna check things, like this. Hey. There's a grapple location here. Hey. Shut up, I'm looking at your thing, your village. Hey. No. This is gonna get really annoying, Over really here. fast. Can I just like avoid her by jumping up hey. here? Hey. Oh, I'm sequence breaking. I'm actually going somewhere I'm not supposed to be, I think. Yet. Um. Ah. Uh, what the hell is all this? I don't know where to go. There's probably a secret around somewhere, like on top of this thing. Actually, this is a pillar, I think. Doesn't have a top. Maybe. Yeah, now I'm just back here. Alright, fine, I'll I'll go and oh god! Jesus Christ, hey! that's a big jump. Over here! Yeah, just a sec. Hi. Welcome oh. to my village. Fine, alright, I'll listen to you. This is the town square, and that over there is Fred's tent. I what? haven't where? seen him in a few days though. Maybe I'll just Elder point Samuel it like up into the he sky. He knows a lot of stuff. Mostly boring stuff. If yeah, holy crap, me, her fucking lips try. or tongue. Before asking him, though, you should check Are you out not hearing village. all that? It's not so bad. Unless you have to stay for too long. That's horrible. When you're done, go to the island with the windmill, and you'll see Samuel's cove from there. I'll go on ahead and tell him that you're coming. He's not much for surprises. Later! I guess it kind of makes sense I seeing Madeline as... and agreed to meet her later. Seeing as they're frog people. strange. How could I talk to someone who was not even human? Human? I still feel like it was perfectly normal. Shouldn't you go on ahead? I can't grapple her. Okay. But I can I can jump on her and kill her this way. You're dead now. Yeah, that would probably kill a normal human being. I guess they're not human beings. Some drawings. Tomatoes. Four tomatoes equals two corn. Yeah, I agree on that. Actually, I think tomatoes are way worse than corn. Corn is the best. Tomatoes are kind of meh. Tomatoes are only good, like cherry tomatoes are kind of neat, and in, like, sauces and stuff like that. I don't really like tomato on its own. Hi, ma'am. Can I have some tomatoes or corn? What's this? Bullet catch! Hold on, I can't really... It's a DVD. I wish I could zoom in. I should have looked at this while she was 
forcing me to be in a cutscene. Bullet catch, the gun, and... Revenge, I think? The gun's revenge. And what does it say above it? I can't see... I just see that as a Cumberbatch Azuman or something. 20... 207 man. I have no idea. You can probably read it. I'm not gonna lean that far forward to see. Hello, people. Sausages? Pork sausages? Great. Shrimp? Ferrero shrimp. What's this? Fish. Okay. More of these. I guess they're not just grappling symbols, they're like something else to these people. So where was Fred's tent? Up there, I guess? Can you get over to this side of the village? I wonder. There's a grappling hook, isn't it? Oh god, I'm stuck. I'm actually stuck. I'm falling forever. How fast is this gonna go? Now, I was expecting a giant impact when I... Oh god! Get up! No. No. I'm dead. We're all dead. Goodbye, cruel world. Oh, now they're actually talking. Okay. Nice. Oh, I can maybe read that. It's probably just more of that same story about the boy and stuff. I guess. Oh yeah, I should probably end the episode. I completely forgot. I was just playing. Yeah, that's definitely something. Maybe you can get over here later on. Oh, nope. Huh. We'll see. But yeah, we'll see next time. So, I'm gonna end it off here. And we'll explore around. This level seems way less linear, I guess, and it's just about exploring and stuff, which is neat. We'll see if it actually is that, or if it does turn out to be linear. But yeah, that's kind of cool. I'm liking this game, and performance seems good. Sorry, I said it. I, I talked about performance, I lied to you. But I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed. Bye-bye.